Welcome to this training session on the purpose of a lightning hole. Lightning holes are cut in rib sections, fuselage frames, and other structural parts to decrease weight. This is why you may see it called a lightning hole, because it lightens the aircraft. To avoid weakening the member by removal of the material, flanges are often pressed around the holes to strengthen the area from which the material was removed. As a matter of fact, a piece of metal with properly flanged lightning holes is more rigid than the metal before the holes were cut. Lightning holes should never be cut in any structural part unless authorized. The size of the lightning hole and the width of the flange formed around the hole are determined by design specifications. Margins of safety are considered in the specification so that the weight of the part can be decreased and still retain the necessary strength. Lightning holes may be cut with a hole saw, a punch, or a fly cutter. The edges are filed smooth to prevent them from cracking or tearing. Form the flange by using a flanging die, or hardwood or metal form blocks. Flanging dies consist of two matching parts, a female and a male die. For flanging soft metal, dies can be of hardwood, such as maple. For hard metal or for more permanent use, they should be made of steel. The pilot guide should be the same size as the hole to be flanged and the shoulder should be the same width and angle as the desired flange. When flanging lightning holes, place the material between the mating parts of the die and form it by hammering or squeezing the dies together in a vise or in an arbor press, a small hand-operated press. The dies work more smoothly if they are coated with light machine oil. Cracks can develop around flanged lightning holes, and these cracks need to be repaired with a repair plate. The damaged area, crack needs to be stopped drilled or the damage must be removed. The repair plate is made of the same material and thickness as the damaged part. Rivets are the same as in surrounding structure and the minimum edge distance is two times the diameter and spacing is between four to six times the diameter. Here is an example of what a repair might look like. If any forming is necessary when making the patch plate, such as fitting the contour of a lightning hole, use material in the zero condition and then heat treat it after forming. This concludes this training session. We hope you found it useful.